This is the special event, the exclusive Back to the Future debate. Believe it or not, right now we are broadcasting to you from the past. Gentlemen, tell us your positions. Hi, my name's Mitt Romney. I'm quite liberal, and I have never agreed with Ronald Reagan's ideas. Also, when it comes to abortion, I will always defend the woman's choice. I believe in big government, and I support more government spending. I'm Ron Paul, and I believe the government is too big. We spend too much, borrow, and tax too much. It's bankrupting this country. I support and defend the Constitution. Wait a second. 1.21 gigawatts. It looks like we are now traveling back to the future. What the hell? Wow, whoa, 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 whoa. Mitt, hold on. Your hair gel is flying all over the place. Wait. I think we've arrived. It's the year 2012. Hi, my name's Mitt Romney. I'm a conservative, and I strongly believe in Ronald Reagan's ideas. Also, I am against abortion and pro-life. I have never supported big government spending. I might as well tell you to believe me when I say, I've been to Mars. Santa Claus flew me there in his magic sleigh. I'm Ron Paul, and I believe the government is too big. We spend too much, borrow, and tax too much. It's bankrupting this country. I support and defend the Constitution. Employment by at least 10% through attrition. And finally, we say to federal employees, you're not going to make more money than the people in the private sector who are paying for you. We link their compensation. Time. Congressman Paul. Uh, no, I'm for an A. That should be the easiest thing to cut. It's not authorized in the Constitution that we can take money from you and give it to particular countries around the world. To me, foreign aid is taking money from poor people in this country and giving it to rich people in poor countries, and it becomes weapons of war, essentially. No, well, no matter how well motivated it is. Paul, would you cut aid to Israel? I would cut all foreign aid. I would treat everybody equally and fairly. And I don't think aid to Israel actually helps them. I think it teaches them to be dependent. We're on a bankruptcy court, of course. And, uh, and look at what's the result of all that foreign aid we gave Egypt. I mean, they're, they're, they're dictator that we pumped up. We spent all these billions of dollars, and now there's a more hostile regime in Egypt, and that's what's happening all around Israel. That foreign aid makes Israel dependent on us. It softens them for their own economy, and they should have their sovereignty back. They should be able um, to deal with their I'm neighbors at should, their own should will. Should we cut foreign aid to Israel? No, we should not be cutting foreign aid to Israel. Israel is our